Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Visha and in today's video we're going to be doing a no makeup makeup look. So if you want to know how I changed my face from this to this, stay with me. <laughs> So today is going to be like my first um, makeup tutorial. I am no expert. This is what I do when I feel like putting on makeup. So this is what I do. And since I was asked to do it, you know, I felt kind of special. So the first thing I do every single morning um, when I get up in general to put anything on my face. First, I use the hyaluronic acid the hype the serum and then I use the pawns to put on my face so let's turn back on my light but yeah this is what I use okay so I already did that I already moisturized my face and then next I go in we're gonna put on my lip balm so my mirror is right here but the way I got my camera set up so you're gonna see me like looking back and forth but I put on my lip balm. It's just a homemade lip balm that I made. So, ah, as long as I ain't made, <laughs> as long as our lips are moisture and then moisturized. So, let's get into it. So, I use the bare minerals tint go this is what i use to put on my face it's the bare minerals complexion rescue tint hydrating gel cream and it has a spf of 30 in it it's a broad spectrum it says apply to clean skin with fingertips additional for coverage well um i really don't do all of that what I usually do and I know this is not correct but I don't like stuff um, on my fingers so we're gonna take my blender and we're just gonna blend it so it is a tinted moisturizer it is not meant to be makeup Yeah, I forgot to do my eyebrows, but work, I forgot to do my eyebrows, but work in the way that is best for you. And I know somebody's going to be like, oh, that is too light. Yeah, but it tints down. So it really does tint down. So next, we're going to go in with my NARS. I love this stuff and we're going to conceal under the eye I'm gonna oh I'm so sorry we're gonna conceal under the eye I gotta keep it right here and I like how dark it is it's like really dark I really like that and I try not to do too much of concealer neither because I am not 22, 23, 19. <laughs> I'm not trying to be Instagram baddie. I'm just trying to look decent for myself. Okay. I don't do the extra. My forehead is already big. I would not highlight that. And I don't do my chin. I would not highlight that neither. Because as you can see, I have a double chin. So I do not highlight that neither. So we're gonna go in. We're gonna go in with that same blender, take it to the other side and blend it in. I'm real simple when it comes to makeup, okay? And now we're just gonna take that line. We're just gonna dab it in. We're just gonna dab it in. Flawless, right? So, I have this um, banana powder. I got it when I was overseas from Primark. And this stuff makes a mess. 
it honestly does but I can tell you that I love it so I just take a small little it's a concealer brush that I got from L and just pat on my face and I'm only putting it in the highlighted spots that well the concealed spots because it's not highlighted I'm not going for no highlighter look this is a elf blending brush I take it and I sweep it off I don't bake so that's done and this is how my face is looking so far I can still see like a little bit but the key to this is blending so I do not bake so now what we're gonna go into I'm feeling it already <laughs> So now what we're going to go into is, let's go ahead and do these eyebrows real quick. I should have done them first. With my eyebrows, if I can find my pencil. Oh, here it goes. I use my, um, what is this? My Brow Wiz in the color Ebony. Y'all, I love this. So... A lot of people might be like, but well, you don't like makeup. So overseas, because I really started getting into makeup like when I was overseas. And the sad part about it is if we live on post, like we had to get like our makeup from an actual like you guys would say a Sephora, but to us it's like just this makeup area <laughs> inside of the px and every time i tried to use like a cover girl or anything like like that or even their concealer it didn't work with my skin complexion so i had to go to nars and use and get theirs in the girl she was my same skin tone and everything and she showed me what would work for me so and I have not been astrayed so I just fill in I'm just gonna fill it in one of the ladies the way she did my eyebrows as you can see one is up over here and one is down she was like that's the way your natural bra is I'm like no sis it's not but you know what we just gonna roll with it because I needed my eyebrows shaped so now I'm letting my eyebrows grow out and like this one is thicker than this one, but like a lot of people say, eyebrows are not twins, and they are not. So that's that so far, and we're gonna go ahead and go in and clean it up. Take my nards again. I go not. I don't go up here. I go here, and I just. Clean it. Okay. I do one at a time. So I'm going to do this eyebrow. And I have a flat concealer brush. And I just. Whatever I have here. I bring it. So. I'm so sorry. I don't want you guys. Like. And I'm very light-handed because you know your brow shape your face and if you mess up, you mess up. And then I drag it down. All right. Like I feel like I messed up, but you know what? That's okay. Alright, so, because I do feel like I messed up, like, a little bit with the lining. So, we're just going to go back here. Mm -mm. Okay, so that's one brow. I'm going to do the top. And the one thing I like about this concealer, because it is very close to my skin tone, I don't have to worry about me having like those little halo eyebrows, because nobody don't want, want that. So, 
okay i do the same thing i do not take my concealer all the way in i will do that when i am shaping it like that see And I will take this one up. All right. And that's that eyebrow. And this is how this eyebrow look. I will be right back once I am done doing this eyebrow. Okay. So I did this one off camera. And like I was telling you, like this one is like this. And that one is like a little bit higher. So she was doing my eyebrow. She was like, is this your eyebrow shame? Like, no, it's not. I had other people do my eyebrows before so no it's not but since I'm done with my eyebrows I just take it the brush like this and do this so it can have it can have that um, gradient effect if that makes sense that's why I try my best not to put too much concealer to the front because we don't want it well I don't want it to the front like look at that and then look at that one it's cute it's cute and what I like to do is go in with my finger it's cute especially for my top okay so we done with the brows <laughs> We done with the brows. All right. So, with that being said, now on to these right here. So, I still take just a little bit. Uh, this is a a banana loose um setting powder. I still take it, put it here on my eyebrows. Like a, let's do sweep in motion because we need that to set, especially under the brow. We need it to set. Okay, we need that to set. Now, here is the trick. We're gonna go in with our True Complexion Contour Palette from Black Radiance. Here's my trick. Here's my trick. Now I go in with Sculpt. I go in with Sculpt, this color right there. And I just take it to the top. I try to make it go back to like my skin color. You're not gonna see it. And that's okay, cause the point is a no makeup, like, you know, a no makeup makeup look. We don't, I don't want it to be too much. So I take it. You're not going to see it still. Now I go in with the deep shade. And you can tell I love it because I'm about to run out. So go in with the deep shade and make my eyebrows, I mean make my deeper now if you want to go with like another color or if you ever want to see me do another color let me know down below and i will definitely show you how i put in like my reds and my um my glitters and stuff but as for this is all that i do that's all that i do and then i take my cover girl my cover girl exact highlights i do not put on eyeliner i am not the best at it every time i try i mess up so i'm not doing that to myself uh take my eyeliner and then i just put it on i do not wear lashes neither this is a very natural look i know some people can get like the natural eyelashes or their lashes are naturally long so but I don't do that I have falsies but I don't wear them they're just here just to be here <laughs> no so I messed up that 
so like how you see how I smudged that right there that's it my finger my finger is like an eraser and move it okay all right so at this moment you can be done and say okay i'm done but to me i'm not done let's go ahead and set my face with my bare minerals my um bare minerals bare skin this is the dark to deep this is how it looks i know some of you are like that's gonna be too light mm -mm. no it's not and then i take my buffing brush by real techniques <sighs> let me tell you guys this is not gonna be too light I take it and I'm gonna go over everything that I just did take away that shine from out of my forehead can you always go under your neck and like you make sure you blend like make sure you blend okay see now the fun part we're gonna do now we're gonna do the Milani this is so pretty very very amour I take my brush and I wet it just a little bit. I take it, go in this like this. Make sure you get some of my brush. Because sometimes this stuff is like hard to come off. Oh, there we go. This is a lot, Visha. Smile. Smile. See that one to that one. And I'll take it again. Smile. That's my blush, y'all. It's so pretty. And I already got big cheeks too, so that's what makes it even better. Cause I already have big cheeks. Okay. So we're doing with that. <laughs> we're gonna go into. I don't know. I have. This I had got from my Primark, so it has multiple pretty, pretty colors. But we want everything to be subtle today. We don't want nothing too bright. We're gonna go in with our little brush we got from Wet and Wild. Take it here, in here. We don't want nothing too bright. I don't want nothing too bright. I'm just gonna take it. A little subtle little glow because I don't want nothing too bright again take it take it because I don't want nothing too bright and you probably like I can't even see it but I know she I know you're there because we don't want nothing too bright huh that's fine with me under my brow bone right here only a little bit the point is not to look like you got too much on okay now i use my finger for this go down the bridge of my nose okay so, and that's it for me with my face. That's all I do. That's all I do. And then, oh, I'm not done. Yeah, that's all I do. But I have to put on my bottom liner. Oh, uh, a good side note, like if you wanna get all your bottom liner, turn your face to the side and you will see your lashes a little bit better if you have short lashes like me. I'm gonna spray. I'm gonna I am using my NYX Makeup Matte Finish. I just spray it. You can do this if you want to, but you don't have to. My lip liner.
it was the collection by JLo by L'Oreal and it's the nude. I am a very let's be earth. <laughs> I'm just playing. But no, I'm a very um I just want natural. Guys, this is my finished look. This is when I want to wear my makeup. This is what I do. It's not even a long process. So it probably only takes me like 15 to 30 minutes every day. It all depends, even if I wear it every day, but this is what I do. Some days I go on with color on my eyelids and then some days I don't. Some days I do actually do put in the um, eyeliner and like today, some days I don't. I just want my face to look as natural as possible i keep looking in the mirror because baby you did this today <laughs> it is cute it is cute so thank you guys so much for watching and like i said let me know down in the comments below if you want me to play with color on my eyelids or if you want a more of a dramatic look um i'm not a makeup artist i just play makeup for fun so don't be coming for me in the comments. <laughs> but until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye.